Hi, I'm Catherine Burns and I'm a graphic designer for the Mercedes-AMG Petronas Formula One team. So I'm part of the design team within our marketing department and our purpose in a nutshell is to support all areas of design across the company while protecting and upholding the visual identity of the Mercedes-AMG brand. We receive a lot of job requests from all different departments across the factory. It's really important that we maintain a high and consistent quality on all of the jobs that we are involved in and every job that we do we want to make sure it's of a high and consistent quality and that it's recognisable as something that has come from this team. In every case we start with the design brief. It's our job to interpret those design briefs, gather all the information that we need from different relevant areas and come up with a creative solution considering budget and the timelines that we have to achieve. The graphics team work closely with a lot of different departments in the factory. We work closely with the commercial team when they pitch for new potential sponsors. We will mock up logos on perhaps different areas of the car, they will then present it to the prospects. We work with merchandise and licensing, we come up with designs for products and we also work on team kit and clothing and support in creating artwork for the manufacturers at Tommy Hilfiger. We also work closely with the comms team, creating content for social pages to celebrate certain milestones. We work with partner services and we create things like digital assets and also ensure that every partner has good selection of imagery from the race weekends for announcements and events. So in preparation for a race weekend, there are jobs that will need to be completed. For example, the track maps. We'll work with the engineering team to gather the statistics that are needed for that graphic so that they're accurate. We will create a set of livery guidelines for every race of the season. These will document updates to the branding for every race, so changes on the car, driver helmets, driver suits, team kit. I've also had the opportunity to get involved with our esports team. I was involved when they were creating a new facility. My favourite part of my job is when you get a job that you have complete creative freedom, just something that you can take from start to finish. I really enjoyed working on the 2021 Championship assets. It was just really cool to see something that you've been working on on your screen for ages come to life and be used around the factory and on people's wallpapers and the star maps were on the doors in the factory. It's just satisfying. Yeah, it's just a really cool thing to say that you contributed to that and the people liked it and it marked a really important milestone for the team. The biggest challenge in my role is that design is largely subjective so it's something that everyone has an opinion on so it can be difficult to find a solution that pleases everyone. Every stakeholder and line manager is 100% happy with so it often requires a lot of open communication and honesty. I grew up in Northern Ireland. I was just watching a race one day and I decided that the paddock looked pretty cool and I would love to work there. So I was probably 14 and my dad said, if you're gonna take this seriously, you're gonna to have to you know, put things into action. So we wrote letters to all the teams in F1 and a few of them got back to me actually and suggested that I play to my strengths, that I find something that I'm passionate about. I'd always been interested in engineering and how things worked and so I thought that paired with the creative element I'll study design engineering so it was all kind of with the idea with the aspiration of working in F1. I applied to do design engineering in Bournemouth Uni and studied there for four years and I worked in McLaren Automotive as a quality engineer and then applied as a Mercedes model designer and got it and was just delighted. I joined the team in 2019. When I started here, I was in a very different role than to the one that I'm currently in. My strengths lay in the creative side of it rather than the technical. I reached out to the head of design, just sent him an email asking if there was any opportunity for me to even shadow someone in the team. He showed me all the amazing jobs. It took me right back to the very start of my journey to F1. Right back to my living room in Northern Ireland on Sunday afternoon, watching the race with my dad. Everything I seen, I just knew I wanted to be a part of it. I just sent him my CV and said, listen, I've really enjoyed my time here and if there was any opportunity that you'd keep me in mind. Started on a six-month contract and yeah, the rest is history. <laughs>